hi everyone welcome back to my channel this is everything dke i'm so glad that you chose to come back if you're new here kindly subscribe like share tell a friend to tell a friend and leave a comment down below i am so happy to do this video i have been out of workout like i've not been so consistent with my workout and i plan to get back to it starting next week and so i thought i'd share this cheat meal video with you and yes so we are doing a beef cheeseburger video and i hope you're going to learn and enjoy the video so let's do this come So for uh, uh, beef cheeseburgers, we definitely need some minced beef, we need uh, cheddar cheese of course, uh, we need lettuce, some black pepper, cooking oil, the buns, I chose the buns with the sesame seeds, I love them better. Uh, we need some chibundiro, I'm using chibundiro because I love to season my meals with chibundiro. Then uh, we have some breadcrumbs, this is to help us with holding of the, the minced beef. Then we need some onions. We will also need some tomatoes, I'll add them as we get along. So let's do it. As Alia mentioned, we are adding breadcrumbs to the beef as it acts as a binding agent. Ndiyo nyama yako isibomoki baki just the minced meat. Then uh, we add chibundiro. Chibundiro is just basically uh, grounded natural spices that gives your food that added extra yumminess. This is uh, the hot one, so you just put a little bit of it. There is the uh, mild and then kunaile without, uh, without chili. Then now uh, we add uh, black pepper, a little bit as well. Then we mix uh, the meat and the spices together. Just make sure it mixes very well. And guys, remember these uh, spices are not the standards to be used. You use whatever it is that you like. So the spices you add are according to your liking. This is what I like. And that's why we're using what I have added here. So once you've mixed it, uh, we go to the next bit of shaping our party. You can... Uh, shape using your hands like i'm doing but if you have ocd and you really want your your meat in some perfect circles you can use any circular object to achieve that so yeah we'll use uh, my hands for that we shape it very well As I'm doing this, I have my pan with some oil heating. You want your oil very hot uh, just to make sure that you trap the flavor and the moisture ya nyama. Because with low heat, nyama itatoa maji na ichemke and we do not want our meat boiled. We want to fry our meat. Then uh, depending on how you like your meat, that's what will determine how long you're going to cook it. Mimi, I love mine very well done. So I let it cook uh, three to four minutes on both sides. Then uh, it might take longer depending on the thickness of your meat. So guys, burgers are my favorite cheat meal uh, because one, it's very easy to make. In about 10 minutes, you have a meal. 
and then it goes very well with any drink either tea coffee but for me Fanta Passion Baridi does the trick so I'm adding my onions to caramelize them I don't like raw onions at all because of the taste and the acidity yeah so I need to cook mine a little bit So for cheese, we'll use the salted cheddar cheese. It's also available at the supermarket. I love uh, how it's packaged. It comes in 12 pieces and uh, every slice is uh, separately packaged, which is really nice because it doesn't stick. So the cheese adds taste and flavor to the burger. So we put it over the meat, on top of the meat. Hakikisha your, your meat and the cheese does not hold together. As in azishikani kwa pan. So ziko kando kando. So I'll cover it uh, for a short while to melt the cheese and keep our flavor locked in. While this is going on, I'll start assembling the burger because the beef is almost done. So I'm going to cut the buns. I'm not toasting my bun because I like them soft. Then uh, I'll spread some mayo. Basically because mayo goes well with raw lettuce. Okay, not because, <laughs> not like I've seen anyone cook lettuce, but yes, mayo goes very well with uh, lettuce. So I spread meal on both sides of the bun. Our beef is done. Very well done. Just look at this. Maltamu. The onions as well. So we start assembling our burger in no particular order. I'll start with the letters. Break it such that it fits on the bun. Now, then we add uh, our onions.
then you add the we add the tomatoes a little salt to taste remember we added salt to the beef and our cheese is also salted so you go easy on the salt some chibundiro okay love this seasoning hey it's actually ready to eat so you can add it to either cooked meals already or just cook it then some mustard just a little bit then we add the meat just look at this meat guys you can just see how well it's done and it's still so moist just look at it I can't wait to dig into this burger. So thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I had so much fun doing this video. I enjoyed every bit of it. And as, as you can see, the results were amazing and very full. And I hope you try the same at home and tell me how it goes. If you've not subscribed, kindly subscribe, share, tell a friend to tell a friend and hit the notification bell so that you're notified every time we put a video up. So God bless you very much. And I hope to see you next. So see you at the gym. We need to get back in shape after all the eating we've done. And guys, God bless you. See you next time.